if you have felt unappreciated, uncelebrated, unnoticed, and insignificant in this kingdom, what is unseen is often what is most significant. Now, not in the world. In the world, we, we, we correlate seen with significant. But I'll tell you what, you could, you could take this pulpit away, and I could still preach my sermon because I really don't need my notes. They're just like Linus's blanket. It's just like a security thing for me. I really have the message in my heart. So you could take this away, and I could still preach. But if the signal that's causing this microphone to make a sound were to drop out, you could no longer hear the message. Why? Because what is invisible is often what is most valuable. And yet, can I keep going? I'm going to do it whether you want me to or not. <laughs> I got you now. Whether we will admit it or not, we are so good at celebrating the wrong stuff. People will always, especially the crowd, give us Barabbas. The crowd will always celebrate the wrong thing. Uh, people will always celebrate what they can see. And another thing that people will always do is, is celebrate a gift rather than celebrating character. We celebrate the wrong stuff. Now, if you do it in secret, and this could refer to anything in your life. If, if, you do, if you do what you do according to your values, not according to external validation, then you understand the meaning of the Father saw. The sacrifices that you made that no one else really pointed out, the stuff nobody gave you a trophy for, what would it be like this year for us to live with God as our audience? But he said, your father who sees what is done in secret will reward you. Say this out loud. My reward. Y'all can't mumble this part. Y'all are so loud about the wrong stuff. Get loud about this. Shout it. Say, my reward is from the Lord. Touch somebody. Say, I don't need a trophy. I don't need a trophy. I don't need a trophy. For everybody who was not appreciated, for everybody who was not celebrated, for everybody who was unwanted, even abandoned, I want you to know your father saw who left you. He saw who should have been there. And when my father and mother forsake me, then the Lord will take me up. My father saw when people mistreated me and I could have got even, but I put it in his hands. He saw it, and my reward is with the Lord.